opportunity to come. Thank you. Uh, so congratulations to everyone um, who is here, who is a graduating intern. I know some of you had the opportunity to come physically to uh, the events in um, Crayford. So it's a pleasure to be here to celebrate your achievements. It's a big achievement. So please celebrate yourself. And also, it's also um, a pleasure to talk about a bit of the exciting world that awaits you in information technology. So obviously you spent hours, you've been learning, you've been practicing, you've been presenting, and now you, the next step is to take that leap into that um, career field, which you have chosen and which you've uh, had the experience because what you've done is actually work experience and the IT field is is just one field with lots and lots of incredible opportunities yeah it's it's not just about I'm sure by now we know that it's not just about computers and softwares but it's it's majorly about three things for me personally and I'm sure you might be able to relate to this. The first is solving problems. You are a problem solver, okay? You, you are going out there to solve problems. So see yourself as a solution provider, okay? And the second is connecting people, all right? And Because you will be working a lot in teams, okay? Because as an agile, um, I'll call you a, an agile, um experienced person now you know what agile means yeah uh, and i'm not excluding uh cyber security and data analysts guys because you you will probably find yourself on on solo projects you know but you're not necessarily working on an agile um theme so you would you would find find you would find that that you're connecting with people you're working with people and of course you have to be able to uh, improve your uh, your soft skills as you go along then the third one is making oh my goodness i love this one making ideas come to life you're going to be bringing ideas to life i'm sure sometimes you will be on projects and you, maybe you said something or you asked a question and everybody, they're like, oh, wow, we never thought of that. Those moments for you will be like, I'm part of something brilliant. I'm part of something good. Okay, so you you, you are problem solvers. You are pe your people connectors. You're going to be networking a lot. Uh, say, for example, uh, a, a scrum master, you, you, you are going to be there, bringing people together, ensuring that um, projects are being, are, being, are being delivered. Okay, and whilst you're doing that, it, it, it's not just about the project, the working with people. You'll be answering questions. So uh, to answer questions from your agile team and answering questions, answering questions from your um from the management of the business the same goes for the business analyst person who is going to be there gathering requirements for products for the problem that you are required to help them so and also see yourself as the moment you get this this opportunity and focus on you see yourself and say there's a need which they want you to yeah, and of course, it's not just it's not just something that they can get off of the train from anywhere. Do you know why? Because if they can get off the train from anywhere, they don't come looking for you. And you have a seat, you have a CV that you put together, your profile. And I'm sure by this that everyone has their own CV. You know, you put that together and they see your CV before they meet you. So in as much as possible, and I believe that everything that you get on this platform has been able to represent yourself better in your CV, because that is what they're going to see for CV. And there's also a great space for you in the IT world. 
for being your own boss, I hope you know that. For being your own boss, I mean, like if you got an idea, you can start your own tech company. Okay, nobody. That, uh, in fact, as long as you're working with different project people that or you are you are solving problems, you are thinking of solving particular problem using technology. You have an opportunity to be your own boss. Uh, then you as as you progress in your career, um, for those that are on the uh on the advanced team, like I always say, make sure you're part of a community. It's it's brilliant to be part of a community. Once you get your job offers, go there, stay there perform and i will say to you that being part of a community will do something for you as well it will speed up it will speed up your progress there will always be some you um if you're someone who is still struggling with imposter syndrome please drop it if you're in the if you're in the advanced thing please you know what you're in the right place because there is no way you'll be in that in the advanced team in the community Okay, there's no way you'll be in that community and you're going to lose your confidence. It will keep building every single day. So even if you get a job offer right now, why you are still struggling? Oh, did I really qualify for that job? Why did they give me that job? You know, that is you still second guessing yourself. But the point is, if they have given you an offer, you've said something really special at the interview. You've made an you've made an impression on them that they did not Two find other more. candidates. Thank you very much for that. So as you start your career, whether in um cybersecurity where you're protecting the digital space or data analysis where you're analyze, analyzing uh, gathering data, analyzing trends and patterns, and providing reports for for the business, or even if you move on from here to go into something like cloud computing because some people might decide to go ahead and do something different from what they've done here i'm telling you the sky is not going to be the limit for you you're just going to keep growing and growing and growing so with all this knowledge and your passion going into everything that you've taken from the platform use it to make a difference okay uh, use it to make a difference i because you have the power you've been empowered to shape the future. So thank you for letting me share this day with you. I'm grateful, I'm happy uh, to see that you started and you finished. Congratulations to everybody. Thank you once again. Cheers. Just want to say thank you. Um, hi everyone, this is Uzo. Some of you know me, I was part of your team. Um, I just want to congratulate you for what you've done. Um, many people start uh, the journey, but they don't, they don't finish, you know, or they don't maximize it, but you guys have. And I, I want you to understand the, the importance of what you've done. You, you've, you set yourself on a course to do something and you followed it through. And the fact that you're still here it means that you're still working on it. You're still improving yourself. I just want to encourage you so, so much. For some of you, you knew me as a PO. And even when I was your PO, I, I know, I, I, you know, you know, it was a love. Um, I won't say hate, but it was a love. It was a love relationship that, you know, when you, you love someone, obviously sometimes you butt heads together, but I couldn't help but even sometimes drop, you know, being a PO and act as a mentor because I saw your heart. I saw that you guys were, you know, really willing to work. You know, sometimes I'm just, okay, I know this is supposed to be a PO meeting, but let me just, you know, talk to you guys about all of that. And I know I pushed you, but, you know, when you see people that have, you know, good quality within them, it's okay to stretch them because when you stretch someone, then they are able to see what they're capable of doing. And I know that some of you came back to say thank you, you know, for the opportunity. And I want to say thank you as well to you guys because the relationship also enriched me. And I want to commend you and just let you know that the the, the world is your oyster. I am a testimony. That's why I was able to stretch you guys because I've been in your position. I know what you know, you're capable of achieving. And I know that once you put your mind to it, not even nothing can stop you. You just decide what you want and you work towards it. And I want to encourage you as well that you don't underestimate the value of community. 
I, I'm so glad I was able to, and I am still able to be part of the advanced community. I can't tell you of the confidence it gives me, even the opportunity to be a mentor to you guys and to be exposed to you because I learn from you as well and I'm better for it. So I just want to congratulate you so much. I'm so, so proud of you. I'm, I'm so glad I can count myself as part of your success story, but it is your success story. So write it, make it the best possible. Come back and let us know what your victories are. Let us rejoice in it with you. And um, yeah, I wish you guys the best. If you need any advice, you need anything, I'm available. You know, you have my, my details. So once again, congratulations. You deserve the very best. Go and conquer the IT world. And yeah, God bless you all. Thank you. All right. Thank you so much. Spot on. Thank you, Uzo. Thanks for always sharing with us. Thank you very much. Um, and I hope one or two people were encouraged with what Uzo has shared. Thank you so much, Uzo. So we'll call on one intent to go. Um, Juliet, are you ready to go? <laughs> are you ready to go? Um, yes, I can go. Okay, so I... I'll put you for three minutes. So go ahead. Okay. Hello everyone, good evening, um, everyone, mentors, fellow interns, new interns. Um, my name is Juliet Adeoye. I came onto the platform, the Blue Sky platform, as a data analyst intern. Um, the motivation behind that was I was looking for a career change. Um, so I currently work in the science, research science department, and I think I was getting bored and I wanted something exciting. And this opportunity came my way and I thought it was worth grabbing. And I'm so glad I did because I've got no regrets, absolutely none. Um, so I came in with very little knowledge of data analysis and you know, straight on into the program, we had the onboarding session, the intro session. I quite enjoyed the intro session because it kind of gave me a flavor of all the different roles, which was quite um, interesting. So even though I came in as a DA, but it was I was able to get a bit of understanding of what the other roles do, like the business analyst, the cybersecurity, and all of that. And I thought that was quite enriching for me as well, and which also helped me within my team to um, gel and collaborate efficiently within the team. Now coming to the role-specific trainings that we had, um, we got very detailed exposure to the data analysis tools that we would need you know, out there, in, in which included Tableau, Power BI, and also SQL. It was, you know, I had zero knowledge of these tools. I had not used them before, but having gone through the training, I can say that, you know, I've got good experience, not, you know, experts, but like you said, I'm not like, you know, uh, limiting myself. I'm going to continue learning to expand my knowledge on that. And it was also good to work within a team um, within the, the Agile framework. Um, I, like, I think someone mentioned earlier that even though we as data analysts didn't, we're not like playing active role within the project, but it was still really good to see how the Scrum framework um, operates from the daily standups and all of the different sprint um, ceremonies that we had to go through, the Scrum ceremonies that we had to go through. And I thought that was really enriching. So I can go out there and you know, throw the buzzwords to friends and you know, just be proud of, of going through the platform. And you know, having gone through the internship, I also have signed up for the advance and I'm really looking forward to the great experience to continue and also expand my understanding, my knowledge, and also you know, build that expertise foundation that will allow me to go out there into the world and do the great things that we've been motivated to do. Um, and I want to say thank you to all of our mentors uh, my colleagues within the team and also within the, um, the, the the internship and to the management team as well. Very big thank you to all of you. Thank you very much. That's me. Wow. <laughs> you waited till time was up properly, like you were really watching the time. <laughs> that was interesting to see. So thank you so much for sharing that, Juliet, and really all what you said. You know, I like when people really explore when they are here, when you, you know, it's not like you just let the internship pass through you. With what you've said now, you passed through the internship, which was very fantastic. For you to be able to see what other people are doing, 
And the reason we do all this is it's not like you now get to an organization, you be a novice to all other roles. So what will the impression of those that recruited you be when they see that it's not like you've worked with other roles, you understand? And that is where Agile, Scrum, and even teamwork in general comes in when you can show that, okay, you understand what other people are doing, you can be empathic with other roles and even understand what they do and all that. So thank you so much for sharing that. I'm happy hearing that from a, an intern that just finished with us. So thank you so much. Um, and by the way, I know I've never said, said it in the group out loud. So um, Juliet was one of the people that were now, she's currently now an admin in Blue Sky. So thank you for your active role and all that. And welcome to the club. So thank you so much, Juliet. You've been fantastic. Thank you. So, thank you. It's a pleasure. All right. So we'll go to the next, next, next. Um, we'll go to the next uh, mentor. So um, who is going next? Should I call Moji or Wilt? Drum rolls, please. Wilt, shoot. <laughs> Wilt, are you ready for us? Oh, yeah, I'm making Poundo in the other room. No, 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 no. I'm good to go. All righty, shoot, please. Thank you. Your time starts now. Oh, beautiful. I'm giving you four minutes. Thank you. Yeah, good evening, everyone. It's been a beautiful experience right there, you know, and um, I'll just briefly summarize my story and my experience so far. I joined the team 2022. You know, I came from an engineering background. My name is Wells Haladipal. So, you know, did chemical engineering, petroleum engineering, worked in an oil and gas, and then moved to UK. And knowing how UK is, you know, it's not where you come and do your oil and gas thing. And I said, oh, how do I get into this IT business? It's IT, because you know IT will definitely be ready for the next century, you know, if you know what I mean. So I did browse around and check and discovered the blue sky. I said, okay, let me give him a call. I had a call and then I really started the training. I was running 10, just like you guys. I enjoyed the three months, it was beautiful. We learned a lot of the projects. And after that, I moved on to join the advanced team. I started learning so much and uh, I put my heart into us and I was very desperate. I learned everything, read everything. I was troubling everybody, all the different mentors. So new for me, Moji, I was calling everyone. Nine, I thought at times 11, you'll see me preparing for, for an interview. Me and Tolu will be there when I'm done. Move to someone else, call Vivian, call, allow me. Everybody, I was just on their neck. And eventually it paid off. I've done several interviews while I was with the advanced team. And uh, eventually, I uh, was called. I got a job as a senior IT project manager. And it really paid off because, you know, during this interview, uh, the way I discussed with those guys, you you would think I've been in the IT industry for more than a decade, you know, because I actually took in everybody's experience to myself. You know, it's like borrowing experience. Because that's the beautiful thing about this family. We all come together and we share experience. Oh, this happened at work. This is how I dealt with it. You know, so those are plus points for every one of us. And it's something that I really would encourage you to be a part of. You know, we all need this community so that we can get the best out of whatever we're doing. So that's my own experience. And I can tell you, I've been enjoying it. Every day I learn. I listen to everyone. And that's why I'm giving back. If you notice the way I also teach people also, because I want you to have a stress-free experience so that you need to grasp more and more at a very short time. Okay, so that's been me. And uh, I think I can, I can only say it will only get better because it's from glory to glory. So thanks to everyone. And thanks to all the bigger guys there, Daisy Park, and you know, and the beautiful thing is every session, they keep adding value, more and more value. So the last intent, what they got is different from what this new set will get. There's always an addition. There's always improvement. Do you get it? So that's the whole idea of continuous improvement. And that's what we see with Blue Sky. So please, just open up your heart, take advantage of what you see, what you have, and make sure you just go out there and be the best. Because even the sky, that's actually your starting point in this business. Thank you so much. God bless you all. <laughs> so that's it for me.
Uh -huh. Thank you, well. Thank you so much. Firstly, for keeping to time, which is strange. Let me just say it now. Thank you so much for keeping to time. And, you know, there are a lot of key things you said to really, you know, that's why sometimes I can't do this without calling mentors, you know, that have been here in the last one, two years. I don't really like calling the Agbani Darigos, but I like the people that is just one, two years. They can tell you what they've done. If you see the passion, someone like Uzo or Wealth, you know, they give back to because they've experienced it. And that's where we're coming. And you, if you heard what um Wealth said now that, you know, he now got a senior role. And guess what? When he was doing the interview, it was like a chat. And this is one key thing they usually say to that. You know, after a while, when you've known something like the back of your hands, when you're, you'll be able to hold a conversation in it. So it now becomes a chat to you. So it will be as if you are not even under any pressure of any interview anymore because you now understand the process. You are living the process. That's how we try to build between Blue Sky and Rita Icons when you transition so that it can become a part of you. You are confident enough to face anybody when it comes to that subject matter. In fact, you automatically become an SME yourself. So you become a subject matter in the aspect of Agile or even your role in itself. So thank you so much for sharing that. And another key thing I always want to add to, you know, just from what we've heard so far is just anything you're doing, just keep doing what you're doing. You might have more, than, everybody has different graces on this. You might just do one interview and that's it for you. But you might need to do 10 for somebody else to get it. But guess what? If you do nine and quit, it might be just that 10 to one that was supposed to be yours. So you don't need to stop. We had a reason why we chose to do this in the first place. So keep doing what you're doing. Don't feel discouraged. It's normal to be weary. Very, very normal to be weary. I always say that thing that, you know, in two months of searching for a job, that two months was like 10 years for me. Like, I've never seen the longest two months in my life for trying to get, you know, a role. But when I finally got, I was not like, ah. So if I was on this thing for six months, I would have been weary. I would have stopped too. Because it's very easy to stop. But this is me now encouraging you that don't feel weary. Just do the right things. But you can't say you're doing something when you're not doing the thing. You know, some people just be in eh, but you never submit your CV. Or you just submit only one and think that is that one that will get you through the door. I, I wish Wells even mentioned that part of submitting 500 CVs. You was, I'm not exaggerating. Anybody that hears this 500 now will say, hmm. Maybe wealth, you say it yourself so that they will hear. So, wealth, stop. Not wealth now. Let's even leave wealth. I submitted CV to the extent that the, the CVs were talking back to me. They'll say, Auntie, you have submitted. Auntie, you've already requested for this job already. That bad. So please, guys, don't relent. Don't feel that, oh, you don't know it enough or you're not good enough. Please send out your CVs. Send it out until all the platforms, all the job um, search platforms will start telling you that you've requested for this job before now. You've already applied for this job before. Then you know that you 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 really tried in searching. So please keep searching. Thank you so much. All right. So we'll call the next person, Ian Ungoma. Ian, are you ready to share with us? Yes. Uh, good evening. Allow okay, me. you have three minutes and your time starts now. Thank you so much. Okay. Um. Uh, th uh, first of all, let me uh, thank Blue Sky. In particular, let me uh, thank Deji and Lady Pat for setting up this platform. I was so amazed, especially on the graduation day, the impact that Blue Sky is having in the community. That Let me start from there. But all in all, I was the PM ADM for Optimize team, a fantastic team. And the, from the platform, I came with zero knowledge in IT, apart from opening the computer, apart from using my email. But the skills that I've learned from January to today is so amazing. First of all, they have given me courage and they have given me confidence. As a, uh, a project manager, I learned a lot of, um, uh, a lot of programs really. I started with the Azure DevOps the things, the program that I could just hear really speak, but uh, being on that platform and working on that platform, it just gave me so courage. I worked with different teams as a project manager. I worked with the BA. I worked with the Scrum Masters. I worked with the developers. That just gave me, gave me confidence really to work with different teams. And, and also I worked on Oracle, Human Resource Capital uh, Capacity, that was absolutely fantastic. So 
you can see that when you come on this platform, first of all, you need to free yourself, liberate yourself. You, you need to launch yourself that I've come, but with an attitude of learning. What I've noticed in, um, uh, on, on this platform is that we are not looking for intelligent people. We are not looking for uh, people who know everything, but we are looking for people who are willing to learn and to put in the hard work. You must be there. If you want it, you must be there and push yourself. I've, since I've been in this country, I've never seen how January month can move. The first part of the, uh, the my year could move from January to this time. From January, just relentless. And I was learning. I was, even if I don't understand something, I made sure I logged in and I was there and I was participating. Just get involved. Throw yourself in. You will be amazing in the three in two months' time. How you know things? Uh, allow me. You always pushed us. Go on YouTube, learn something every day. So for me, my technique was every day. I must spend probably about an hour on YouTube, an hour at least. Look, if if, if people spend one hour to pray, why can't you add another one and one hour to do something? Somebody said to me, whether you're rich or poor, the equilibrium is that everyone has got 24 hours. It's how you're going to use your 24 hours on this platform to change. And it's the only person who can, the, who can change the course of your career, the course of your life is you. If you decide to go this way and you stuck your gun to that one, that's what you will be. I can guarantee you. I can put my money. When Deji announced advanced program, the very day, even before he finished, I had already submitted my application. I had already submitted because I want to continue. Lady Pat, I still remember on graduation, I think I, had a, I spoke to you. Uh, even if Deji speaks most of the time, the few words that you sp you've been speaking, they have impact. You always mention this word, be within the community. You see, you have to be within the community where you will be involved, where you'll be shaped, where you'll be challenged. I, I can't forget on the last day when the assignment were coming thick and fast. And I was saying, how, allow me, how do you expect me to finish this? But you, guess what? You need to make time. As you're coming on this program, you need to make time. There are some friends you need to cut off. There are some of the things you have to forego for you to be on this program. And you know what? The benefits will be fantastic for you. There will be no one is going to take off that certificate from me, the one I've worked for, because I worked for it. So let's go. Come on this program and be effective. Thank you, Allow Me. Thank you so much, Ian. And really, that was spot on coming from you to really thank you for sharing that. There's something we always say in Blue Sky. When you join Blue Sky Internship, something must give. And that's what you just explained. You need that extra time. You need to utilize these three months so that you can get the best out of it. And guess what? Nobody can do it for you. You can only do it for yourself, right? So thank you so much for sharing that. Thank you. Ian, so um, we'll go to our next mentor. I'm even tempted for the next mentor to just wrap up for us. So, okay, before I call the next mentor, um, Biodo, do you want to go next? Then I will now call one more intern. Signify with your hands up if you know you want to share your journey. Just one more intern. So we'll just let the last mentor wrap up for us. Anyone wants to share their journey? Biodun, you know you're next, right? But any other person wants to share their journey? I'm surprised. I thought I was still like 50 hands up. Okay, that's fine. If you still change your mind, I'm watching it. If you want to share your journey, please feel free to raise your hands. Biodun, do you want to go next, please? Yes. Okay, so Angela, you go after Biodun and that's it. Okay, go ahead, Biodun. All right, good evening, everyone. Thank you very much for the opportunity given um, to be on this platform. Um, I will say right from the start anyway, right from the beginning, to be honest, I don't know what to do. 
Um, I've been working in housing for over six years now. And me trying to divert into IT, I was like, honestly, I was worried. So I don't know what to do at first. So um, I was introduced by a friend and I just went on the end and I just signed on for Scrum Master. And at the beginning, anyway, we had the onboarding section. It was great. It was wonderful. And I remember actually taking on the nerves to coordinate that at the beginning and, yeah, um, trying to know ourselves and everything. And later on, anyway, I realized that, okay, the program is something that you really need to commit yourself into. You need to stop doing some things that, you know, they are not, let me just say profitable. Let me put that word, profitable. Um, apart from having your normal job you're doing, but there are some things, maybe you love watching films, I had to cut down on that because um, if I don't cut down on that, I will not be able to meet up with the expectation. And as, as a Scrum Master, you need to be there to help your team, um, to shield your team. And also um, when they ask questions, especially our team anyway, Team Legends is a very special team anyway. As the name implied, legend. Honestly, it was it was great. We had a lot of great people in there, and it was amazing to meet different people there. And for us to at, at first, we're not bonding, we're not connecting, we are always having like I don't know buzzbuzz. Let me just put that at the beginning. So, but it was interesting because at the end of the day, we then we we later start bonding together, and then start getting along with the project. And as Uzo said, um, she's one of the people which is very straight on the platform. She wants the job to be delivered. At, at first, I was like, okay, trying to say, trying to shield the team, saying, okay, we can't commit certain stories and, and things like that. But later on, I realized that, okay, um, she said we have to do it. To be honest, I, I realized what I learned from that is that you need to remain firm. You need to be able to work from your last matrix to see, okay, we can't do this. We're not going to be able to meet up and be firm with it. Even if we have a street PO or we have a, um, a deadline that we need to meet up with, if we cannot, we need to protect our team in general anyway, because, um, for us to be able to protect our team, we're gonna end up, we're gonna end their trust and they will know that okay, we all know what we are doing at the end of the day anyway. So it's not just pushing things and overworking ourselves. And along the line, I also learned a lot of things anyway, because um I had to do some self-learning as well, because there are some things that were missing. That's why I said committed, we have to be committed, we have to actually um. Um, I, I will I say our mentors, they've been interesting, they've been helpful, and we had there's a lot of help on the platform. As long as you're ready to, you know, to go ahead and ask for those help, there are a lot of help. Um, the admin, they've been helpful, the mentors, they've been great. And every meeting, if you commit to it, I believe that we're gonna you're gonna learn from it and you improve as time goes on anyway. For each print for our own platform, we keep improving, and which was great at the end of the day. So for me, it's been an interesting journey. And one thing I've taken on board is that I'm I'm not I'm not into the advance as well. And I feel like going into the internship, for you not to lose the skill, it will be advisable for anybody that is here to also join the advance because I just feel like it's easy to lose. And for you to be part of a community, it just shows that you're ready to grow at the same time. Because even at work, when you get a job, you might still find some challenging issues. But having to be on this platform, I feel it's a safe place. Um, thank you. Thank you so much for the help. I wasn't well prepared for this, but thank you so much for the help. It was fantastic. You couldn't have said it better, even if you had um, 50 years notice, right? Thank you so much for sharing, Biodu. Biodu, too, was one of the very, very active um, coordinators during the program. She was really fantastic, too. So thank you for sharing this, Biodu. Um, we'll quickly run to Angela. Um, you see that all the interns that are speaking so far, they are saying something must give. You just need to get that extra time to improve yourself. So I hope the, those of us on the call, please just try. Even as you've ended your internship, don't pack all your distance and say, I want to breathe. Don't breathe. Just continue. There's no need breathing. Just continue. This should be your breath. This should be part of you. So thank you so much, Bielda, for sharing. That was really, really great. Thank you. Um, Angela, do you want to go? So I'm going to give you two minutes, Angela. Okay. Your time starts now. Thank you. Good evening, everyone. 
my name is Angela Boda, and um, I would love to say thank you to Blue Skies Citadel for giving me the opportunity to be part of this group. I joined, well, I was introduced to the group by my younger sister. Her name is Esther Deyemi. Um, I didn't know what I was doing here for the first two weeks. I, I was like confused. I thought, can I cope? Will I be able to do this? I actually, um, I've been a photographer for years. I moved to France and I started working as a cashier. I wanted to change my career. And I thought, okay, I still want to be in that line of my photography, but I need to do self-development. And I spoke with Lady Pat. She encouraged me on what to do. Coming into the group until the third week, I started feeling, okay, I think I can pick up from the beginning. I went back to all the videos. I brought out a note. I started writing out. I listened to all the videos. I started writing out everybody's uh, points, responsibility of every group. I started reading during my break time. Like uh, Biodo said, you have to give out some things I don't watch movies like that. I don't, I, I reduce my time on the phone. Sometimes and the boss, when I'm coming back home, I say, I, I joined the class. I sleep, I'm still in the class, you know. We are like one hour different from UK. Sometimes into 1 a.m. I'm still in the class and I wake up 5.30 every morning. When I'm at the gym, I listen to the audio. I try to develop myself because I'm this person that I don't grab much when you speak. I write. So I listen to the video. I write. I read up. That's the only way I grab things and I understand things fast. So I just want to encourage others. It's not going to be easy at the initial stage. You might feel confused. You might feel lost. That was how I felt initially. But uh, after we finished past two weeks, like I felt, I felt empty. Coming back home, I'm coming back home. I'm not in the class. Nothing is happening. I miss Blue Sky. I miss the group. I miss everything. I just want to get back immediately. So thank you for giving me the opportunity to be part of this group again. I've joined the advanced group and um, I'm looking forward to doing great things with the group. Thank you. Oh, thank you, Angela. I could hear the passion in your voice. <laughs> thank you so much for sharing that was really great to hear so and it's really encouraging and i like something you know especially that you said you see once you know yourself just do what works for you i like that you know yourself you know your way of learning and all that you are like me like you can't be talking to me and i'm ah, except i'm not with a paper even if i'm not with a paper or this thing if need be, I'll just open the notes on my phone and start writing it, you know. So it's really good. Once you know yourself, how learning is for you or how you want to capture things and write on it. Thank you so much for really sharing. And trust me, joining the advance, you made the right decision. That confidence you're looking for, that knowledge addition that you're looking for, you're going to get it. And you will saw you'll be the best amongst your peers in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you. So thank you everyone really. So we'll just take the last mentor. I'm also going to give you four minutes, Moji. We'll take the last mentor to just wrap up this segment for us and then we can do our other things. Time is fast spent, but we're still gonna finish right on time. So Moji, you have four minutes. Once your time is up, I'm gonna take the mic. Thank you, your time starts now. All right, okay. thank you so much, Laon. Um, good evening, everyone. My name is Moji Olaiwala. Um, it's a privilege to be given this opportunity to just share one or two things with um everybody and be able to relate with you with what I want to share with you tonight. So um it's I'm gonna start with the new intent. I know you're here and any friend that you've called along to come on board to, you know um just maybe they might just be curious to say okay so what what is it what, what have you registered for and everything um some few years back also I, I had an opportunity to me and um I wasn't even on the career change path I I, I was working as an housing uh officer 
and then I had to leave of childcare. So I wasn't really looking for to change career or anything, you know, when the opportunity came and I was told about it and everything. So yeah, I joined, you know, I was uh, curious. Okay, so what do they do? They, why do I need to go and learn and all that? And then by the time I knew it had to do with, is a bit technical and all that, I almost ran back because I'm not a technical person. I know zero knowledge about technicality. And even though as an office officer, I work with a computer, I don't know, you know, the nitty gritty. I have an IT person I call when I have a problem. So I don't want to, you know, kind of fill my head with that. And that was the way, you know, that was the feeling I had when I joined then. But I will, I'm grateful that today I didn't drop off. And I will tell you why I didn't drop off. Because of the warmth, you know, when I started attending the meetings, the introduction meeting was, you know, the the things that you were saying during the introduction meeting and all that. I don't know, maybe he, he had to lick honey or something before he starts talking to us, but there's a way he, when he starts, you just get glued and you want to know more, you want to hear more, you know, the friendliness, the, the smile, you know, the jokes he puts in and all that. Those are not the things you see CEOs doing. The fact that he was, he's a normal person down to earth and all that, that attracted me, you know, got me going to say, okay, so what else, what else, what else? And by the time we started, you know, gradually there's support from mentors who are there. I know the ones that I've just graduated, you would be able to relate to what I'm saying. You know, the coaching, the people, the fact that you can, you can call people, the tutors that are coaching you are demonstrating to you with practical things. So you're not just hearing big English and all that, what you're hearing, you're seeing what they're doing also. And that goes a very, very long way. You know, because even there are times when you read textbooks and all that, you don't have an understanding. So you would enjoy that on this platform. If if you are skeptical, believe me, you are in the right place. Now, for the people that are on the advanced platform, the people that have just graduated and you're the advanced platform and you're maybe a bit still, you know, skeptical to say, okay, so what is going to happen to us on the advanced platform? You know, um, the lady that just finished talking, please, forgive me for not remembering your name, said something about after leaving the internship, she feels, you know, she felt empty. My my class is not there anymore. Um, I'm not meeting and I'm not doing everything. Welcome to the advanced platform. Yeah, where you will continue that and you will do much more. So if we've held your hands while you're on the blue sky um, um, platform, when you're on the advanced platform, we're expecting you to go in front while we're looking at you and guiding you through. So you have the opportunity to grow for that. I had that opportunity when I finished the internship to jump on the advanced platform to develop myself further in whatever I am doing. And believe me, there is support for you. It's not just the things you are learning alone that you will get here. There is interview prep for you on the advanced platform. You will be guided. You will, your, your CV, Lady Pat spent hours with me on my CV. She's the one reviewing the CV. I'm the one wondering, ah, we've spent so many hours. How dare me? I can't talk. Somebody's helping me and I'm talking. She's using too many hours. You know, Tolu is there always calling and checking. When I give up, there are times, I'll tell you the truth, that I gave up. I I, I kept getting the nose and nose and nose and I just, you know, I just packed up. I didn't go to meetings. I didn't go to any. They didn't leave me. They kept checking up on me. Maybe what is going on? Are you okay? Are you applying? Are you doing this and that? And there is monitoring that you are actively searching for that job. That you will do that. He will check up on you. You will tell us the number of job applications that you have done and all that. At times it feels as if the pressure is too much and all that, but you need that pressure because the people outside there are not relenting. So you shouldn't relent also. You are not a number. You are not a statistics with Blue Sky. You are a person. You're seen as a person. You are dealt with as a person. We're not just marking statistics. Oh, uh, 5,000 people have passed through us uh, because we need that to do this. And that, that is not why you're here. That is not why you're in Blue Sky. And that is not why you're in Rich Icons. That is not why you joined the advanced platform. You are some you join us, you'll be a part of us, and then we'll take your matter on our head. You know, when when we say, um, I know we, we referred to God with that song, you carry my matter for head. We do that here also. And then the the pastoral care, stand in gap and pray and intercede for you. That is another level. And I tell you, I don't know about other platforms out there that, that would do that, but I've not seen it. I've not heard of it. I've checked. I'm telling you, I have not seen and I've not heard of it. 
sorry, how much did you think you paid for this course? 600, please go and check outside. They are doing much more. People are paying much more and they are not getting half of what you're going to get here with the 600 you're paying either for Blue Sky or, adv or Advanced Platform. What you're getting is far, far more than what you put in. And that is why you see people who are ready to sacrifice to say, what I have gained, I am also ready to give myself to make sure that other people are, are going to get the thing, the same thing. There's another thing I learned being a part of this great establishment, and that is the act of giving back. I know how to give back before, but when I joined this platform, I know it on another level. People gave their time. People spent time. They've gone to work. They are coming back. They are tired. You're calling them 10 p.m., 11 p.m., and they are jumping on the call with you with patience to take you through things. You find that on this platform, and that is sacrifice. And that sacrifice, you need to make it work. So but one thing I'm going to say is be warned. Be ready to work. You have to be hardworking. To get what you want you have to be committed to get what you want you have to be patient to get what you want you have to have a heart that wants to learn a heart that is ready to be corrected a heart that can be focused to get what you want for the people on the advanced platform welcome the 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 job is getting uh uh, more now there is more fire on you now that you're on the advanced platform more focus the binoculars is now you know zoomed in on you but you will get that thing you want. Have you just joined Blue Sky? You are on the right path. You've come to the right place. You're on the right path because Blue Sky doesn't just pass through you. Apart from the your role that you've come to learn, believe me, there are other things you will learn. You will learn how to be resilient. Everything I have learned on advanced platform, Blue Sky, I am using now at work with ease. If I've not gotten going, I've, I've not gone through all the things I went through. I'll be struggling now at work. And believe me, even though I am working, the support is still there. I find some things challenging at work. I am running back to this great family to call on people to, to you know, tell them I need to do this. They're saying this, what do I need to do? And everything, even while at work, I'm testing and I'm getting response back. That is what you get with Blue Sky, which you will not get anywhere. Quote me, I'm saying it. And I'm proud to be part of this establishment. Thank you, Laomi, for the opportunity. Thank you so much. Well said, although you owe us some time. So, but well said. I couldn't stop you. My church mind could not stop you. <laughs> Thank you so much for sharing with us. Thank you um, to all the mentors and all the interns. Or no, let me not call you interns anymore. All the graduating yeah. interns. Uh huh that have spoken tonight, really, thank you guys so much. Sometimes why I don't even really take my time to say my journeys because I honestly don't know how to cut it short because if I start now, we'll not finish. But I just want to tell you guys that it's a journey for everybody and you will achieve what you want to achieve if you put your mind to it and do the right things and listen to when you're told to do things. Some people will be told to do things, they don't apply themselves, they give excuses. Trust me, you're not the only one that likes excuses, but, you know, say, for example, there's some people that probably did not still submit their end of um, um, end of program report and all that. Those are just excuses. I know, yes, there might be one or two cogent ones, right? But the others might just be pure excuses, which is what every cohort will go through, definitely. But if you do what you need to do at the right time, apply yourself so you achieve what you want to achieve and the sky will be your starting point so thank you everyone so we'll move to the next segment quickly and that will be presentation of certificates to all the graduating interns so we'll hand this over to deji and deji you have 10 minutes for this session thank you for those guys that for those guys that are not here can have them also screenshot on, on the video. So like I said, before we start recording, so if your names are not mentioned, that means you did not actually pass. Is it that you didn't submit your uh, end of program report or you submitted is not satisfactory? So yeah, so that's why your name is not here. So some, some people have called me, and say what well, with that what should we do so if you're in that situation there's no other options than for you to redo the program again 
because we are not going to issue certificate for people that that report is unsatisfactory. So that is very, very important. We got standard to maintain and we want to maintain it that way because we want people within the program to say, oh, go to Blue Sky. Once you are able to graduate from Blue Sky, I'm very, very sure that, yeah, you know what you are, you, you, you are meant to know. And we've actually got that testimony from people after the person has finished, he just called his friend. I've just finished from Blue Sky. And this person said, yeah, if you're already finished, I, you're doing this particular role. I've got a friend that you can speak to. And the person sp spoke to that friend. And before you know, and that's it, job done. And this person is now working in that company now. Okay, all right, let's go through the names. Okay, the first person is um, Angela Okay, Angela Eboda. Yeah, Angela Eboda, uh, who has successfully completed the project management course. Thank you so much, Angela. Let's give Angela a round of applause. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. No worries. Okay, all right. Next person is uh, Api Ebuzume. Api Ebuzume for project management. We have Apu, Api on the call. Happy, okay. Nena. Okay, all right. So, okay. The next person, Oluwa Shibumi Asuni for project management. Oluwa Shibumi Asuni for project management. You have Oluwa Shibumi on the call. Oluwa Shibumi Asuni, okay. And next person is. Ian Ngoma. Ian Ngoma. I think we have Ian. Actually, congratulations, Ian, for completing the project management uh, program successfully. Well done, Ian. Ian, do you want to say something? I think we had from Ian already. Anyway, okay. Next person. Yes, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank no you. Really worries. appreciate. No worries. Okay. So the next person, Oluwa Jare Oluwambe, Oluwambe, who has successfully completed this Chrome Master course. Do we have Oluwa Jare on the call? Oluwa Jare on the call. Okay. All right. So next person is Oluwa Olanre Waju Mudupe Oluwa Shalom. Olanre Waju Mudupe Oluwa Shalom. Uh, so it's really completed this Chrome Master course as well. Okay, well, congratulations to Sharon. And next person is Shukurat. Shukurat Biodun Sulaiman, who has completed the Scrum Master course as well. So do we have Shukurat Biodun Sulaiman on the call? Okay, so next person that we have yeah, is... Oh, okay. Thank you, Deji. Thank you. All right. Yeah. yeah. Congratulations, Brandon. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So, am I, if you want to do a screenshot of that, that I would wait for a few minutes. Yeah. Let me know. Done. Done. Thank you. Ah, cool. So, okay. So then the next person, Samuel Olumide Ajay. Samuel Olumide Ajay has successfully completed the quality assurance course. Uh, congratulations to Samuel. Do we have Samuel Olumide on the call? Okay. Uh, so I guess not. So um, the next person is Robert Ikechiku Okongo. Uh, was also completed this Scrum Master course as well. Uh, Robert, congratulations. Do we have Robert on the call? Okay. And next person is Oluwa Sheye Akin Walere. Oluwa Sheye Akin Walere, who has successfully completed this Scrum Master course. Do we have Oluwa Sheye on the call? Oluwa Sheye, okay. Congratulations to Uluwashe. Okay, I think we've done this one. Okay. So the next person is Oluwa Timilei Olumide Oluwa Kaude. Oluwa Timilei Olumide Oluwa Kaude, who has successfully completed his Chrome Master course. Oluwa Timilei 
Okay, do you have all that similarity on the call? O gunti me, o gunti me, sorry, o gunti me, o lumide, o luwa kawede, o gunti me, o lumide, o luwa kawede. Okay. And next person also has completed the Scrum Master certification, uh, who is Oluwa Muke Shegun Ayodeji. Do we have Ayodeji on the call? Ayodeji on the call. Okay, congratulations to Ayodeji. And next person is Ebon Oluwa Po Oyetunji. Ebon Oluwa Po Oyetunji, who has successfully completed the Scrum Master course. Ebon Oluwa Oyetunji. Ebon Oluwa Oyetunji. Okay, and next person is Oyenaye King David. Oyenaye King David, who also completed the Scrum Master course um, successfully. Do we have Oyenaya King David on the call? Oyenaya King David, Oyenaya King David, okay. And next person that we have right now is, okay, all right. So certificate of achievement to uh, Ibukun Baba Damilari Akilo, Ibukun Baba Damilari Akilo, who has successfully completed the Scrum Master course as well. Do we have Ibukun on the call? Okay, congratulations to Ibukun. And also we have Jen on Dai Bate, apologies for Jen, Jen Dai Bate who also has completed, successfully completed the Scrum Master course as well. So, okay, do you have him on, on the call? No, okay. And next person is Idowu Christana. Idowu Christana, so who has successfully completed the Scrum Master course as well. And do we have Idowu on the call? Idowu, are you on the call? Okay, uh, cool. Next person is Fajones Kuje, uh, who also has completed the Scrum Master course. Congratulations, Kuje. And also, we have Alo Oluwashi Makinde, Alo Oluwashi Makinde, who has also successfully completed the Scrum Master course. Okay, Alo, congratulations to Alo Oluwashi. Uh, we also have Abimbola Omolara Luwe, Abimbola Molara Luwe, who has also successfully completed the Scrum Master certification. Uh. Thank you so much, Daisy. Thank you, Bluska. Right. Okay, all right. If you want to do a screenshot of that, we'll wait for a few minutes or a few seconds, that's okay. Yeah, that's okay, so okay all thank right. Thank you. No worries. So and also certificate of um, certificate of achievements to Ainde uh, Emmanuel Olapode, who has also successfully completed the quality assurance course as well. Ainde uh, Emmanuel Olapode, congratulations! Thank you, so, Deji. Thank you, Blue Sky. Congratulations to you. Okay, do you what, do you want to take the screenshot or actually move forward? Yeah, done. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. So, and also certificate of achievement also to Lawal Bamidele Emmanuel, who has also successfully completed the policy assurance for 2024 April. So, congratulations to Lawal. Congratulations, Lawal. Also, we have Oluwal Olan Rewaju Usman Akim. Bambi, Ade Bambi, rather, Olan Rewaju, Usman Ade Bambi, who has also successfully completed the quality assurance. Uh, congratulations to you as well. So we also, we got also Damilola Joshua Oyewale, Damilola Joshua Oyewale, who has also successfully completed the quality assurance course for- Thank you, Deji. 
congratulations to you, Damiola. Congratulations. Do you want to take the screenshot and okay? I got a copy. All right, cool. Thank you. <laughs> All right. So uh, and also certificate certificate of achievement to obvious to Friday Steven for successfully completing the quality assurance course on 13th of April 2024. Congratulations to Obviousu. And also another certificate issued to Omar Jowo Thompson Olamili for successfully completing the quality assurance course. Congratulations, yeah, Thompson. Thank you very much, DJ. No worries. Okay. So please around take the screenshot. Okay. Uh, thank you very much. God bless Blue Sky. No worries. So another uh, certificate of achievement goes to Ayodele Benjamin Olakule. Ayodele Benjamin Olakule, who has also successfully completed the course for quality assurance. Congratulations to Ayodele. Congratulations. So the next person certificate of achievement to Ogunyemi S.A. Ibukun, who has successfully completed the quality assurance uh, on 13th of February, 2024. Congratulations, Ogunyemi S.A. Ibukun. Congratulations. So we also have certificate of achievement given to Gideon Obadari. Gideon Obadari for successfully completing the quality assurance course. Well done, Gideon. Congratulations to you. So we also have certificate of achievement given to Abimbola Afolabi Olaide. Abimbola Afolabi Olaide for successfully completed the quality assurance uh, course in 2024, April. Congratulations to Abimbola Olaide. Okay. Another certificate of achievement presented to Adibayo Papalola Jose for successfully completing the business analysis course. Congratulations to Adibayo. Congratulations to you. And also certificate of achievement given to Wrote to me Ikubai uh, for successfully completing the business analysis course. So I want everyone to kind of warmly help me to congratulate this particular person, to be honest, well, because uh, I think we also gave another uh, award to, to him because this person is a king in Nigeria, is Royal Majesty, uh, is Excellency, uh, is Royal Majesty uh, Oba. The king Otimi Ikubaibe, and for him at his status and his caliber as well, for now starting to kind of say, Okay, he wants to be part of Blue Sky, is real an honor. We want to say thank you to His Royal Majesty, the King Rotimi Ikubaibe. Thank you so much for, yeah, uh, coming on this platform as well. So it's an honor to, to have you. Okay, certificate of achievement also to Oladele Olabode Joseph, Oladele Olabode Joseph for successfully completing the business analysis course on April 13, 2024. Congratulations, Oladele, congratulations. Another certificate of achievement presented to Mebu Anla Miga. Uh, for successfully completing the business analysis course. Uh, congratulations to Mebu. Congratulations. Yeah. And another certificate of achievement also to Oluwakemi Morolayo Mosaku for successfully completing the business analysis course on 13th of April 2024. Congratulations to Ulua Kemi. Another certificate of achievement is due to Oyin 
Sola Folari, Oi Consola Folari, for successfully completing the business analysis course on the 13th of April, 2024. Congratulations, Oi Consola. Uh, also, another certificate issued to Oluwakemi Murala of Mosaku for successfully completing the business analysis course. Congratulations. Another certificate of achievement presented to Oluwa Bukumi Olanri Waju for completing the business analysis course. Congratulations, Oluwa Bukumi. Certificate of achievement proudly presented to Ogoro Omolulu Jeremiah for successfully completing the business analysis course on the 13th of April. 2024. Congratulations to uh, Jeremiah. Also, certificate of achievement presented to M. Tamilola Yomi Adetula for completing the business analysis course. Congratulations to Tamilola. Congratulations. Certificate of Achievement also presented to Olu Fade Samson Temitope for successfully completing the business analysis course on the 13th of April 2024. Congratulations, Olu Fade. Also, certificates presented to Moji Sola Oluwa Tuyosi Ajayi. Moji Sola Oluwa Tuyosi Ajayi for successfully completing the business analysis course on the 13th of April, 2024. Congratulations, Mujisola. Certificate of Achievement also presented to Mashud Adewale Adeyemo for successfully completing the business analysis course on the 13th of April, 2024. Congratulations to Mashud. Certificate of Achievement also presented to Monei Oluwashim for successfully completing the business analysis course. Congratulations to you as well. Certificate of Achievement also presented to Michael Akwede Simon for completing the business analysis course. Congratulations, Michael. Certificate of Achievement also presented to Olayinka Clifford for successfully completing the business analysis course. Congratulations. Uh, congratulations also to Lamure Temitope Blessing for successfully completing the business analysis course. Congratulations to you. Yeah. So, and also congratulations to Adaramola Tumishe Augustina for completing the business analysis course. Congratulations, uh, Adaramola. Another certificate of achievement presented to Adedure Oluwashi Oluyinka for successfully completing the business analysis course issued on 13th of April, 2024. Congratulations. Another certificate of achievement also presented to Adekule Mobolaji Dairo, Adekule Mobolaji Dairo for successfully completing the business analysis course. Congratulations, Adekule. Another certificate of achievement presented to ODA Temita question, ODA Temita question for successfully completing the business analysis course from Blue Sky Citadel. Certificate of Achievement also presented to Ogundipe Adeyemi John for successfully completing the business analysis course on the 13th of April 2024. Congratulations to John. Certificate of Achievement also presented to Far Moduro, Far Moduro Abisoye Messi for successfully completing the business analysis course. So congratulations to Messi. 
certificate of achievement also presented to Ade Olua Bamidele, Ade Olua Bamidele for successfully completing the business analysis course on 13th of April 2024. Congratulations, Ade Olua. Certificate of, of achievement presented to Ade Shola Elizabeth Adegwe for also completing the business analysis course on the 13th of April 2024. Congratulations, Ade Shola. Certificate of Achievement also presented to Fumilola Olola de Coca, Fumilola Olola de Coca for successfully completing the business analysis course. Congratulations, Fumilola. Also, Certificate of Achievement also presented to Alade Olubenga Olalikon, Alade Olubenga Olalikon for successfully completing the business analysis course. Congratulations to Olalika. Certificate of Achievement also presented to Belinda Ashte. Belinda Ashte for successfully completing the business analysis course on the 13th of February, 2024. Congratulations, Belinda. Also, certificate of achievement presented to Chiamaka Aigu, Chiamaka Aigu for successfully completing the business analysis course. Congratulations to you, Chiamaka. Also, certificate of achievement presented to Esther Adeyemi for successfully completing the cyber security course on the 13th of February, 2024. Congratulations, Esther. Certificate of Achievements also presented to Abiyoye Babatunde John for successfully completing the cyber security course. Congratulations. Certificate of Achievement also presented to Agbara D. Ebele Agata for successfully completing the cyber security course. Uh, congratulations, Agatha. Certificate of Achievement also presented to Adepoju Said Babatunde for successfully completing the cyber security course. Well done, Said. Congratulations. Certificate of Achievement also presented to Mezini Alessandro for successfully completing the cyber security course. Well done, Mezini uh, Alessandro. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Congratulations. So, Certificate of Achievement also presented to Owen Chu Chukwemeka Numoye for successfully completing the cyber security course. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Thank you. Owen. Thank you. Congratulations. Yeah. Also, Certificate of Achievement also presented to Abba Solomon Anoluakpo for successfully completing the data analysis course. Congratulations, Albert. Certificate of Achievement was also presented to Juliet Adoye for successfully completing the data analysis course. Thank uh, you. Thank congr you. Congratulations, Juliet. Yeah, thanks. Certificate of Achievement also presented to Odie Monde Daniel for successfully completing the data analysis course. Uh, congratulations to Daniel. Congratulations. Certificate of Achievement also presented to Miriam Vincent. Miriam Vincent for successfully completing data analysis course that was issued on the 13th of April 2024. Congratulations, Miriam. Certificate of Achievement. Uh, was presented to Olua Sheung A. Ogundana for successfully completing the data analysis course. So, well done, Olua Sheung. Congratulations. Also, certificate of achievement presented to Sultan Olua Damilola Shubuale, Sultan Olua Damilola Shubuale for successfully completing data analysis course. Congratulations, Sultan.
or Sultan, sorry, Sultan Oluwadamilolua Shubowale. Also, certificate of achievement also presented to Adedeji Sholaton, Adedeji Sholaton for successfully completing the Aja delivery management. Congratulations to Adedeji. Okay, I think. Oh. Sorry, one minute. Thank you. So, yeah, uh, certificate of achievement presented to Aditeji Sholatan for, uh, for agile delivery management. And certificate of achievement proudly presented to Max Olufemi Adigbite for completing the agile delivery management. Congratulations to Max. Congratulations. So yeah, that's everyone. So that have been able to successfully completed our program. So congratulations to everyone that has been able to to finish. So it's we know it's very, very intense and eventually you did it. Not everyone actually finished. Not everyone, even that finished, was able to turn in the end of program. So I want to congratulate everybody that have actually submitted and also presented and also get feedback. For, so it's now for you to go out there, right? Get the job, right? So it's very, very important. And if you also want to be part of the uh, and the community, as Pat said, don't leave the community. It's very, very important. There are a lot of things, encouragement, and also helping you to get onto your next, next role. If you have not applied for the advanced program, if you still want to do that, so I'll see extend it for this week, okay, that we are entering right now. If you still want to join, then because the other guys have done the onboarding last week, okay, no, on Saturday. Is it on Friday anyway? So yeah, please do join. So okay, all right. Thank you. Can do the nominees at least. Then no always among the nominees if that's okay. Okay. All right. So the first um award category is the best team in January twenty twenty four um cohort. So uh the nominees are Eagle Legend. Optimize elites. Apparently, all the teams got nominated, but our, our eagle was consistent across all the nominations. So the winner is the eagle team. Well done, guys! You keep starting, guys. <laughs> well done. So, um, best scrum master intern goes to King David Oyene. So that Woo! is um that's a team member from Eagles team, I, yeah. Come so, on, King David. Congratulations, King David. I'm sure we all saw him at the in the uh, initiation of the project. Yeah. And now we supported this team. So no doubt about it. And all that nominated were Biodo Ido and Abimbola Lui. Well done to you ladies. Wow, yeah, my girl. Congratulations, Biodo. You really worked hard, you deserve it. Yeah. My girl. Well done. Right, thank you. Thank you. The, yeah. So, and the best QA, please let's uh, send emojis and let's just um, applaud them as I call out the names. So, best QA intern, Ogunyemi Ese Ibuko, Emmanuel Aide, Damilola Oyewole. And that award goes to Ogunyemi Ese Ibuko. Please let's. Uh, <laughs> another and I would also want to uh, comment uh, as well because she logs in from Nigeria. I mean, like, if you're logging in from Nigeria and you actually stood that in a program like this, you should be proud of yourself. So the next one goes to the best BA intern. And the nominees are Ola Dikupo, Emiawo, Rita Ogundiro, Rotsimi, Ikubai, wow. So, and the winner is Ola Dikupo, Emiawo. Olad is a BA with the best BA intern. If you're here, congratulations Woo! to you. Oh my well god, to this home. So, and the best DA, that's the data analyst intern. Uh, so we have four nominations: Juliet Adioye, Sultani, Monday Odie, 
Solomon Albert. And the winner of this category goes to Juliet Adiri. Well done, Juliet. Congratulations. So, okay, this one goes to thank the you, best thank agile. You. Well done. Thank you. Oh, thank you, Juliet. Uh, the best agile delivery manager and PM intern. So this person stood out as an agile delivery manager and project management intern. Three nominations. Zekia Belo, Ian Ngoma, Femi Matsadigite. And the winner is Ian Ngoma. Congratulations, Ian. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. We heard you sharing your testimony, so I'm not surprised. I'm sure you just won the public votes. Your ability to engage with your team members as well. Well done. Thank you, Bruce Kai. So, uh, yes, and the best cybersecurity intern. So, well, okay. <laughs> I love this one. Uh, it was, I would say, all of them, like, they all, they all stood, they, they tried their best. I'm always in their classes and I just, you know, I'm just so proud of them, especially this set. So we have three nominations. Adepo Jusaid Baba today. You guys voted. Lightning. Men Menoye. Um, we have Agwarachi Ebele Agatha. So and the winner is Lightning. Menoye. Congratulations, oh, Lightning. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Everything. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> From inception, uh, it came with you. everything. Yeah, Simply, I appreciate it. 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 I your tutors, Mojisola Olaiwola, Temidayo, uh, we have Olaumi Adele, and you voted your best Scrum Master tutor, Mojisola Olaiwola. Congratulations to you, Moji. You I just keep you. grabbing this, you just keep gra grabbing this award back to back every time. Well done. Yes, Great. So um, the next one goes to the best business analyst tutor. And we, oh, guys, we only have two nominations. So we have uh, Oke Okunfolami, and we have Boluwatife Odekomaya. And the winner is Boluwatife Odekomaya. Drum roll. Well, That's my girl. Um, yeah. Okay. So we have the best data analyst to talk. Um okay, so we, we have two nominations. Ayo Deji Oloyo and we have um Ebenezer. So these two um they both got it was a tie, really. So we didn't really have to announce who won and who did it uh win, but both of them were they had a tie, so we didn't have a winner. So I mean, like that's that's it, and we didn't have a chance. Both of them to... are winners. Yeah, so both of them, both of them are winners. Yeah, that's it. Thank you. So, and the best cybersecurity tutor, you guys voted. So, uh, you, James Akimbami, and um, myself, Pat Emmanuel, and you voted, and you decided to give me the award. Thank you very much. Yeah. <laughs> That drum roll was <laughs> I was almost like, what was that? <laughs> Thank you so much. It's really an honor. So um the best quality assurance tutor. Now you guys decided to go in break that into automation and manual. So for automation, we have Onyo Dukudu, we have Rita, and we have Yemi. So you voted and you voted Oni Odukudu as your best QA tutor. 
Congratulations on your year. Thank you. Next is um the best quality assurance tutor, and that's for manual testing. So we have Rita and we have Yemi Ayola. And you voted, and you all voted for Yemi Ayola. Congratulations to Yemi. Thank you. Thank you. And uh, we have um, the product owner to tour. Okay. Three nominations here. We have Okio Kofolami. We have Emmanuel Osazua. And we have Tululoko Yusufu. And of course, you guys voted and you voted Tululoko Yusufu as your winner. Congratulations Ooh. to you, Tolu, if you're here. Well done. She's here, but she's in the other room. <laughs> she's in the kitchen. Well done. <laughs> All right. Yeah, we have a few more. Um, and we have a Scrum Master body that stood out. We all know what this body is do. And so for those of you that are graduating now, you are coming back into the internship as buddies. I hope you know that. Aha. So please get ready to body the new interns. So we have the Scrum Master body that stood out. Uh, we have Ijioma. We have, is it Jane? Diabete. We have Kenneth Unwokocha. And you voted Ijioma as your winner. So congratulations, Ijioma. Well done. Um, IG, IG, is that's a uh, mommy Gio, yeah? Yes. yes. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right. <laughs> she got that nickname on this platform. So we have um business analyst buddy that stood out, and we have three buddies here. Uh, Ulufunke Osho Adiola. Then we have Uluabu Kola Babalola. We have Matthew Rohit. Congratulations to you, Olufunke Osho Adiola. You won this nomination. Well done. And we have um, the data analyst buddy that stood out for your set. We have Peace Afolabi. We have Jennifer. And the winner is Peace Afolabi. Well done, Keith. Great. <laughs> That's nice. This drum roll is, this drum roll is serious. <laughs> yes. <so. laughs> yeah, we have also Scrum Master Buddy that stood out. So we have two nominations here. Uh, yeah, we have only a few buddies on the platform. Yeah. So we have Babajide Balogo. We have Chris Weideji. So you guys nominated these two people and um, the winner goes to Babajide Balogo. Well done, Babajide, if you are here. Thank you very much. Okay, thank you. <laughs> uh, so we have a few more. So the quality assurance body that stood out, uh, and is that, okay, all right. So we have Rebecca Okoyemi. All right. And we have another buddy, Harold Olutu. You voted and you decided that your winner is Harold Olutu. Congratulations to you, Harold. Thank you very much for the hard work. Uh, I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised you got onto the nominees list. So we have, yes, your powerful developers. <laughs> The developer is not speaking to us. The developer is not responding. The developer is not showing up at our sprint meetings, you know, but you you nominated three of them. We have Akiola Debayo, we have uh, Rexford Orkand, and we have Ola Anthony. And your winner is Rexford Orkand. Congratulations to you, Rexford. Thank you for the hard work. And... Um, we also have the Scrum Master Mentor. We've moved on to the mentors now. The Scrum Master Mentor that stood out for your set. So we have Mayowa, we have Vivian, and we have Timidayo. Of course, you guys voted Vivian as your winner. Congratulations to you, Vivian, for winning this 
um, award, then we have the business analyst mentor that stood up for your set. Oh, this we have four nominations. Goodness me. John Okusoya, Janet Kayode, Femi Akomolafe, and Bimiliki Maru. And you all voted Bimiliki Maru as your winner. Well done, Bimiliki Maru. Congratulations Ooh. to you. Yes. And we also have the data analyst mentor that stood up for your set. Two nominations, Ayodeji Oloyo and Busayo. And you voted Ayodeji Oloyo as your mentor that stood out. Congratulations to Ayodeji Oloyo for winning this award. And we also have um, your quality assurance mentor that stood up for your set, uh, Alex and Oni. You all voted and you voted Alex as that mentor that stood up for you. So congratulations, Alex. Alex is the QA mentor. Great. Thank you. Then we have the Agile Delivery Manager that stood up for your set. So uh, we have Delphine, we have Ken, or Pabu, and you voted and you decided that Delphine is the winner of this award. Well done, Delphine. Congratulations. We love everyone that's been nominated. Well done for standing out. I mean, like, I always say to people when they come on this platform, I say, try to um take ownership try to uh, try to try to step forward to responsibilities in your team you start to build your confidence from there whether you know what you're going to do or not just nominate yourself i'm going to do it if it means you have to go and research ask questions these are all the things that you'll also be doing at work so if you do it here consistently it won't be difficult for you to do it out there at all. Now we have this recognition for selfless contributions on the platform. Like it's so obvious you see that you, they're, they're not just mentors, they're not just admins, they're not just tutors, they're not just buddies, you know, and um, we have the best, um, best um, Blue Sky Citadel admin that stood out for your set. All right. And um, these people just handle different, um, they, they handle different things. And I'm sure you've nominated, uh, you've, um, you, you've seen the names, you've recognized, you've spoken with them. So the, we have three nominations and um, everyone, they all had a tie. Okay. And I'm going to call out their names. So, Olawumi uh, Adeleye. Thank you very much for the hard work. You are so much recognized and uh, appreciated. I must do drum roll for her. <laughs> <laughs> so that is Olawumi Adeleye. And um, we also have Bolu Atife Udukomaya. Thank you very much, Bolu. Uh, for all for combine for being able to combine every there are times like we just have to just come together and have that quick meeting, you know, or everything operations and mean and now strategies and all that, you know. Um, and we also have Mbolaji Okola, who handles the onboarding process. And, you know, there are some people you really don't see their faces or hear their voices here, but what they do behind the scenes, goodness me, you cannot even quantify. Thank you very much to these people. And we also Thank you so much. We also want to recognize um, um, people, tutors, buddies, and mentors for taking initiatives, initiatives around around the the roles, initiatives around identifying problems and quickly uh, applying, adapting, and taking um, bringing up solutions. Like I said earlier. We are all problem solvers. Just let this career, let it become a lifestyle. And then when, even when you're getting paid your six figures and all that, you, you're not even going to think about it as work because it's becoming a lifestyle and you're just enjoying it. So we have the recognition for Ayo Kogi, uh, our project management tutor. Congratulations, Ayo. We have uh, for Puluatife. Udukomaya, thank you very much. We have for Mujisola Olaiwola, uh, uh, ADM, 
um, tutor we have for Olawumi Adeleye, we have for Onyi Odukudu, and congratulations to everyone. And um, of course, we have the recognition for support. Um, Olufunke Osho Adeola, BA, we have Ijoma Otoroku SM, and we have Babajide Balogu and so we have Babajide Balogu and Chris in cyber security. We recognize them for the support. I mean, like it, it's not easy sometimes. In you know, I say if you're in Nigeria, of course, there's a lot of things now. Uh, I want somebody who uh, wanted to, yeah. We wanted to share, uh, who, who did we ask to share a camera now? She said there's, there was no light, you know? That is one of the challenges. And then if you are supporting someone in the UK and you, you live in the US, you, you can imagine how awkward it will be because of the time difference. But of course, we are recognizing this support. And uh, we also have for Janet Kayode, Bimeleke Maru, John Okusaya. We have for... Wealth, Aladito, thank you, Vivian, uh, Scrum Master, and of course, our uh, um, cybersecurity uh, mentor, um, James Akimbami. He actually got the cybersecurity mentor recognition on this platform. We acknowledge everyone that has been part of this journey. Uh, we love you. We thank you for the selfless contribution. I mean, like it's it's not always easy. You know, you have to log in at night after you've gone out and done all your day activities. You know, when you're supposed to be to be in bed or or, or engaging in other family commitments, but you've chosen this time, you know, to commit. And of course, you did not just commit; you stood out throughout the whole period. Congratulations to everyone and to everyone who came on the platform, who started and completed. You showed up for yourselves. Congratulations to everyone. You are all winners. Thank you very much for tonight, everyone. God bless you. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. So now, Certificate of Achievements. This certificate is proudly presented to Vine. Kizoba Mwosu no Munoye. Munoye. Thank you so much. Yeah. For successfully completing the business analysis course issued on the 13th of April 2024. All right. Congratulations. All right. Yeah. Drum rolls. Congratulations. Uh, okay. All right. Cool. And like Pat was saying, is one of the, one of the kings in Ondo State actually and coming to to the program. So I uh, really want to say thank you for for that. It's really really good anyway. So to have someone like him on the program. So yeah. So thank you, and also I want to say thank you for for everybody for turning up on on this call today. It's really really good to have you. Thank you. Over to you.